Mac Voices is supported by Text Expander by Smile. Find out just how powerful a few keystrokes can be at TextExpander.com. Mac Voices is in Las Vegas for CES. I'm Chuck Joyner. Folks, this is Eli of One Bag Tag, and he has the potential to solve a problem that I've had, and that is lost luggage. Eli, it's good to see you. Good to see you as well. Regards from CES. Yes. Um, thank you so much for stopping by. One Bag Tag tackles a very known challenge where every time a passenger checks in at the airport, they have to wait in line for a disposable paper tag. In addition, bags get lost all the time. It costs the airline industry billions and the passenger, you know, obviously, heartache. This device replaces the need for a paper tag. Should I, can I show it? Sure, by all means. Um, so, yeah, yeah, thank you. So this, this has an e-ink display. You check in via the airline app and it syncs via Bluetooth to the device. And for each trip, it'll put up the relevant barcode so instead of having to wait in line, you have this. And in addition, the device is built in with global tracking. So it has a small SIM card inside, and it's going to know wherever in the world. If I'm in New York and the bag is in Singapore, it's going to be able to track it. And now the cherry on top of the cake is we have a built-in weight scale. <laughs> so that we make sure that... Brilliant. Brilliant. <laughs> Over here like this. Yeah. That is absolutely brilliant. So you, you said you check in and it syncs. So what is it syncing to, the airline systems? Yeah, let me, let me quickly show you. You see here? So you check in on the airline's app, you get a barcode, the, and then via Bluetooth, it'll put it onto the display. You see? So is this something the airlines need to adopt? or? So we're ready, we're ready working. There are already five major airlines that are Lufthansa, Air France, but the true um, Swiss, there are some other names, but it doesn't take much for an airline to be able to take it on. There's no cost to them. There's nothing they need to really change in their systems. Th these are the same existing barcodes. Nothing, there's nothing different. So airlines are slowly but surely joining on. Um, so obviously it has to be battery powered in some fashion. How long does the battery last? It lasts 30 days. And actually, the, believe it or not, this is one of the reasons why it's so thick. One of them is that it, it should be durable. But we went all the way back to the old fashioned days of two AAA batteries. And the reason for that is because we're TSA and FAA approved them, they have so many lithium flammable rules. So these are completely, you know, as old fashioned as it is, it's completely non-lithium, non-burnable. Is that a word, non-burnable? It is now. <laughs> it is now. Yeah. I love it. Um, no, that's that's great. And I like that because if I'm somewhere, yeah. you know, I can, I can swap the batteries out. Exactly. Um, which is which is a question. So I get to the airport and I realize I've done my scanning, I've done my syncing, but I haven't replaced the batteries for a while. Will so it maintain the the information while I swap batteries? This is this e-ink display. Once it puts the information on, it stays here even for five years. It stays engraved. You see, this is an actual live screen, which, by the way, is completely bendable because we we can't have a regular screen because what if it falls down? So this is actually the most important component uh, uh, inside the device, so yes. And also the scenario of battery being too low is unlikely because the app is going to warn you up front uh, if you're below 30% and stuff. So, so you thought of everything? Yes. Uh, are these on the market at this point? Not yet, no. Okay. These are the first prototypes. We're proudly showing them off at CES. We hope to be within three months, two to three months. We're almost there. And do you have pricing established at this point? It's going to be somewhere, probably 129, uh, somewhere in that range, which actually value-wise, a decent tracker, just the global track in itself, costs 80 dollars $90. So this has so many other features and a very strong global tracker. So, Perfect. Ivan, thanks so much for the time. The website is? OneBagTag.com. Perfect. Thank you so much for coming by. I appreciate it. Good to see you. Take care. Thank you, Chuck. Folks, more from CES in Las Vegas. Thanks for watching. Visit macvoices.com for show notes and to connect with Chuck on social media. Get involved in our Mac Voices Facebook group and get more out of your Apple tech with Mac Voices Magazine, free on Flipboard. And if you find value in it all, consider supporting us at patreon.com slash macvoices and join these folks who help keep Mac Voices coming to you. Advertising handled by Backbeat Media at backbeatmedia.com 
Bandwidth provided by CashFly at CashFly.com.